the polar equation, and I'm going to recommend on something like this to use software, all right, at least initially, and then think about the images that you're given. So I'm going to go to uh, a web browser, and I'm going to open up uh, Wolfram Alpha. That's Wolfram Alpha, A-L-P-H-A, dot com. All right. This is a low bar of computer algebra system. It's one I do recommend that you start off with. So wolframalpha.com, return. And what I want to do is I want to type in what I'm looking, for, looking at. And what do I want to do? I want to graph it. So I'm going to type in graph or plot. I'm going to plot R squared. And it's good software. Equals. It looks like four sine. I'm going to click four times sine. Parentheses. I'm going to type in theta, T-H-E-T-A. All right. Hit return. And I'm going to get a picture. And I see the picture they're giving me over here. And what do I do? You know, maybe I typed it in wrong. Maybe I don't understand. Whatever. Let's take a look at what was given over here in my key, which is something you want to pay attention to. And I see it over here. 